Hello and welcome back. In this one, we want to fix this spacing and also this ugly thing right here. So what we want is as soon as we hit enter here, we start validating our product and add the details down here. All right. So first things first, we want to get, let's see. Yeah, we want to get this and tab it in. All right. And now if we run this, the spacing is gone. All right. So that's great. Now let's fix this. So we simply say multi line and make it false. So by default, multi line is set to true. So whenever you hit enter, you're taken to a new line. All right. So now let's also say on text, on underscore text, underscore validate like this. And set it to root dot update underscore purchases. All right. So what this does is, as soon as the user hits enter, this function is going to be fired. All right. And let's now let's create this function. All right. So go to your root, and down here, let's define this function which takes self. And first things first, we want to get the code, all right, of that code input. So self dot ids dot we called it code imp so dot code underscore imp and get the text out of it. All right. Let's also get this where we want to update our products, which is this box layout. So we're going to call it products underscore container and it's going to be self dot IDs dot products. All right. Now that we have those, let's perform our validation. This is going to be dummy validation. All right. So we're just going to say if code is equal to one, two, three, four. So if the code is valid basically all right we want to say we want to add the details so let's create the details box it is it is a box layout and the size we want the size hint y all right so initialize it to none and the height is going to be 13 all right now let's also Let's also create a position hint and let's target the top value and make it one. All right. Yeah, one should do. All right, great. Now let's create our label. So go up here, import the label class, dot label, import the label class. All right. Now we can simply say, Let's create a dumb product. So name is equal to label. And the text is going to be equal to product one. All right. What else? That's it. So now copy this. Paste it a few times. All right. And change this. The first one should be code, in fact, so the code is going to be the code itself. And now quantity is going to be one, all right? Then discount 0, 0.0 and price. So the price price is going to be zero again lastly let's add the total and make it well since the price is zero the total is going to be zero all right now let's add these to our details box so details dot add underscore widget and let's add the code 
copy this, paste it, change this to name, quantity, oops, quantity, discount, and price and for the last one total all right so control us to save this and you know what let's also take care of the sizing so let's say size hint and size hint x is equal to let's start with point two for this Copy this, paste it here. Mm. Let's see, let's say point three there. All right, paste this and point one, point one, point one, and for the total point. Two should work so control s to save this run this and let's type in one two three four hit enter and now we can't see it right but let's try that again and the problem is color so color is going to be equal to the teal colors so point oh six point four five point four five and one all right so let's test with just that one one two three four okay so we forgot to add our details all right so product container dot add widget and add the details box now run this and one two three four and we get our product all right so now let's copy this color and paste it here and here Oops. All right, so now run this again in valid syntax where right there. All right, so run this again, and now one, two, three, four, hit enter, hit enter again, and we have that problem. All right, so to fix that, we just go down here and Let's first change this to a grid. All right, so grid layout like that, and we want only one column. So control S to save, now run this. One, two, three, four, and again, 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 and now we have our products. All right, so that is it for this one. I'll see you in the next one.